What's going on, y'all? It's your boy, man, Radical Brad and motherfucker. Y'all thought y'all wasn't gonna see me again. I already knew that. I already knew that for a fact. Gone for like two months, bro. New setting. You see the background, bro. Adult things, the really adult things been going on, bro. The real radicals knew I was gonna come back someday, someday soon. I'm gonna tell y'all what happened. First, got a new job. Yeah, man. Yeah. Moving to a new apartment, bro. You know, as y'all can see from the background, I ain't gotta say too much, bro. Real adult things, man. You know how to edit, bro? Drop down in the comment section below. Matter of fact, Follow me on Instagram, Brian Not Again, or Jiggy Not Again, one of them shits. But Ryan Not Again is my main one. Hit hit my DMs if you know how to edit, man. And nine times out of ten, you know how to edit better than me if you hit me up, bro. You know what I'm saying? I don't really do too much with my edits. So hit me up if you know how to edit. Enough of me spazzing and giving y'all updates about what's going on. You see, I got the standard desk. I can move around, man. Move around back here. Move around up here. You know what I'm saying? Let's get right into it get right into it bartender's like yo what can i get you if you see me looking to the side i'm making sure my shit's still recording because it, i've come to habit where this shit doesn't really record you know what i'm saying i learned that from my previous videos bro i would have to start it over bro beer or something fruity i'm going off personal experience i ain't gonna lie to you i don't really like beer like that you know i tasted beer this is really not my thing i i can i can accept something fruity paul so I'm picking something fruity off rip. Let's see what she's gonna get me, bruh. All right, love. Whoa, 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 bartender, bartender. Don't get too, yo, don't get too flirty, you know what I'm saying? I'm about to buy you a drink, chop it up with you talking about some, all right, love. I know you talk, told a hundred other dudes, call them love. And I accept that, you know what I'm saying? I accept to be a thousand and one to be called love by you. So, you dig? With the umbrella? Come on, you could have asked me if I wanted the umbrella with it. I'ma still drink it though. Josh pops up. Where have you been? What you mean where have I been? In Europe. What about you? <laughs> Yo, where have you been? I haven't seen you. So you got jokes now. I thought we were gonna kick it on the trip, but I haven't even really seen you. Where have you been, Josh? And bro, you skipped both of the group events and even sleeping the whole time. This is the first time I even really you bro I you've been on a hiatus you've been gone just like I have I needed to sleep after the night I had at the bar last Thursday <laughs> you ended up leaving with those two girls right count it bro one two we went back to my house and I played some games you know but we were drunk and started wrestling and damn it was a good night he capping or you think he real you think Josh I think Josh might he might be solid on the story, man. I'll give him that. We don't really know Josh too much like that. But I think he, he for real, for real. I don't know. We'll see. Enjoying the ladies. I you know it. And don't get me started on the London girl. While you guys are at museums, I've been learning about London directly from the source. Is that the bartender? She just gave me the drink and left? She done with her shit? You can see girls back at home. Don't you want to do some things you can't do back at home? I am doing things I... You know, can do back at home if you catch my drift. London girl. I get your point, bro. I get it. I chuckle was just something else, bro. Oh shit, gotta go, man. I'll see you around. You already know. You already know what Josh is up. Josh is up to no good. He, he's sniper. Sniper rifle. Sniper rifle. You know what I'm saying? He after damn left so fast I couldn't even say bye. You know, you can't you can't um mess up on your your chances, you feel me? Here comes Charlie as wearing that shirt with those pants was a pretty brave choice. What you, what you mean? What you mean? <laughs> what, do you, what, what do you want, Charlie? What do you want? What? I can't make conversation? Or do you think I'm going to try to sleep with your bar stool as well? You see how he bucked up? He bucked up like this. I mean, let me, let me know you if you want some, Charlie. You know what I'm saying? You know, I don't know what your deal is. The whole fake nice guy attitude is low key pissing you off. It's almost fascinating how, just how narcissistic you are and how heavy you deflect. You calling me narcissistic? You don't even know me, Charlie. You don't know me at all. You just know me off a few interactions, bruh. Calling me narcissistic. First, you thought I was being kind to the girls with the hidden agenda. But now that you know I'm gay, you've lost the ability to connect those dots. You can't comprehend being nice without an agenda. Because you yourself aren't nice with him. He just spit bars. I ain't gonna lie. I'm not nice with that agenda. How you know about me? Why you telling me about myself? I'm nice with that agenda. Okay, Charlie? 
you reflecting on yourself you not nice to have any gender can you saying that taking time to think about who you really upset with might be a good idea you don't know anything about me if you're trying to tell me who i am and what i do you've been around for like a week bro talk to him alex you only been out here for three days it's only been three days he ain't been he ain't on me for like months and years talk to him alex sure i may do some dumb shit but that doesn't make me a horrible person at all you can make excuses for your actions all you want but if others are harmed by what you do especially if these others are people i've grown close to bro you only been here for a week and you already been growing close to these people they don't know they don't really even know you and you don't really know them so you need to chillax bro gaining all these relationships so quick don't even know these people then you can be assured i'm going to have an issue with you regardless of how me how you may feel stay away from my friends stay away from me no one asked for you to come around and play so throw on the cape like you super hit like you a superman superhero or therapist fucking messiah because you ain't then you can be assured i'm going to have an issue with you regardless of how you make it you can be mad at me all you want we both know you're really just mad at yourself because my words resonate all right they they kind of hit they kind of hit the narcissistic talk the saying i'm not nice without agenda all right you got that i know you got something up your sleeve charlie let's believe i'm gonna figure it out if it may be the last thing I do. Fuck him. He doesn't know me. I'm not letting him get to me. As he sip on his little drink with the umbrella. Let me take a sip. I ain't gonna lie. That's a little bit zesty, Alex. You close your eyes drinking with the fruity drink with the umbrella in it. That's real zesty. I ain't even gonna hold you. Mm-hmm. Should you be drinking that? It's rose your business if you want to drink you could just say that. i could just see if there's another bartender that didn't leave for a shift just gave me a drink and dip well it's legal here in what happens in london days in london you know you know the vibe that bro you only gonna find out later on sooner sooner or later <laughs> glad to see you students taking in the full europe experience some of us are others are sleeping all day or skipping out he throwing shade to josh Reminds me of when I was in school, I went on a trip to Mexico and spent a bunch of time with the salsa dancers. Missed out on everything. <laughs> I didn't know you liked dancing. I ain't yo, Miss Rose, we can, we, we, can, we can get a little dance going on, Miss Rose. There's a lot that students don't know about their teacher. That's true. You know what I'm saying? Teachers got a whole new life. They, they damn near live double lives, bro. They be all teaching this, teacher that, playing by the book whole time they got a whole only fans on the side whole only fans bro teaching kids and you got a whole <laughs> true but if you want to know something about mr lee all you have to do is ask that man's an open book and i'm not guess i wouldn't know anything for you ma'am okay so that wasn't the bartender the bartender is still here you know what i'm saying we was at the like where was she was she wasn't mixing no drinks you know what i'm saying or none of that she dipped, so I thought the girl that left that Josh chased after, I thought I was the bartender. No, thank you, not for me. I was just heading up to my room. Speaking of what happens in London, stays in London. Room 404, 10 minutes. Don't be late. We on demon time, man. We getting a choice? Oh, no choices. So it's automatic, bro. Did she just say what I think she said? She's a very pretty lady. <laughs> Let's best believe she's my teacher. Why would you, bro? Why would he say that? She's my teacher. What face she gonna give this man, bro? I want to know. I want to know. And doesn't change how beautiful she is. All right, I thought she was gonna give like a a weird type of face. Cause she, you know, she is fine. <laughs> True. You know, this hotel gets a lot of tours and I've seen all types of groups. Pretty rare for students to drink, even rare for them to drink alone. What you trying to, what you trying to insinuate? You want to drink? You want me, you want me to buy you a drink? I won't be down here long. Someone will either come down and join me or they'll blow up my phone. What you need to do when that 10, when that 10 minutes hit, you need to be up to 404. Alex, I'm not playing with you. I'll dead ass delete this whole game from my damn storage, bro. For my memory card, I'll, this is probably the first time I've had a few minutes to myself besides being asleep. Someone hit you up. Why are you checking your phone for? You got a you got a little sneaky link date. Ten minutes full four. You need to be up there, bro. You ain't no shoot. Ten minutes hit. Dude, I'm up there. I'm at four four. Little zesty ass still sipping the drink. Like you ain't just got. 
took it long enough to sip that. 10 minutes. Oh, okay, okay. Okay, I see the vibe. So he he was checking the supposed time. It was a it was a black screen. We ain't know. You know what I'm saying? We ain't know what the uh, what was going on. But he was, you know, we're gonna play, we're gonna act like he was checking the time. You know what I'm saying? Why would we pick don't go? Huh? Huh? Go <laughs> like we we've been waiting for this moment for a long time, you know what I'm saying? Tell her I said hi. <laughs> Shit, bartender. Why don't you join? Yo, College Kings, there should have been a choice of saying, why don't you join us? What happens in London stays in London, right? Right? If y'all agree, put down in the comment section below that the bartender should have been having the option to be invited upstairs, you know what I'm saying, for a minute. Look, it's dead. Look, look, it's dead. Ain't nobody here, bro. Bartender can leave for a good 10 minutes, you know what I'm saying? A little good 10 minutes. <laughs> Not no, we opening the door, man. Why would we not? Opening the door is the is the is the way to go, bro. Somebody tell you this? You, you better try to open that door first. You already got the invite. So we won't try to open this door, bro. Yeah, yeah, it's old, it's old. No. 